All right, so the enzyme that's most likely deficient in this disease is found in which part of the cell? So what enzyme is deficient and then what disease? So what disease first? What disease are we talking about and then what enzyme? All right, 18-year-old woman, severe leg cramps. Interesting, we're catching the bus, running to catch the bus. Yeah, I, I think he's okay. an issue with my, my others already. Look at this guy. All right, burning sensation while running for half a mile. Mm. I feel sore. Again, with the cramping, she slow uh, slow walks without experiencing. Okay, uh, biopsy is obtained. Okay, so normal, 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 normal. Here we go. Cranning kinase is crazy yeah. high. Yeah, yeah. And we got myoglobinuria. Not good. Yeah. Therefore, you said it is what? I said it's macardos. Macardos. Excellent. So now here's the real question. Mm -hmm. The enzyme that's deficient, where is it found? Uh, I know it's not E. All right. It's not D. All right. Uh, C, maybe. All right. Goji apparatus, no. Okay. Cytosol. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll go with A. All right, let's go with A. Nice job. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's right. Because this is not. This is. This does not play a role in the mitochondria. This. Mm -hmm. uh, this pat. This process. This uh, glycogen breakdown is not in the uh, mitochondria. That's so it's right. strictly outside in the cytoplasm. Very nice, man. And yes, this was McCardles. You got it. You yeah. got it. They like to say that, uh, you know, if it wasn't a boy, they'll say something about um, when he was lifting, as after lifting weights, his arms feel like spaghetti, or, you know, they get better after drinking like Gatorade or some sort of Gatorade like oh. Powerade, something oh. like that. Yeah. Uh, okay. okay, look, goes down to G. Very straightforward. We'll see. All right, deficiency in which enzyme? Deficiency of which enzyme? Two year old. Yeah. Weakness. Um, muscle weakness. I'm walking. Walking. Muscle wasting. Right there. Demyelination microfish. Demyelination. Oh. Mm-hmm. Demyelination and then staining with toluidine blue. I guess that's a big buzzword, but. I see a child with demyelination disease. Yes, that, that's, oh, that's, that's the disease you're talking about. Uh, the one that has to do multiple sclerosis in children. Sounds good to me. What is that called? <laughs> that name is difficult. Okay, but do you remember the, en <laughs> do you remember the enzyme that's, def <laughs> that's deficient? <laughs> uh, I have to go through it. I know, Just, okay, I know eliminate. Not, eliminate. G. Yeah, it ain't G. G. All right. Well, what else is it not? It's not, Just it's eliminate. not E. It's not E. Yep. It's not D. Yep. It's not B. All right. Okay. Okay. It's not F. Good. And now we're down to two. Yeah. Uh, oh, man. I thought that was... Uh, a good bottom answer. <laughs> Excellent job. Excellent job. Arrow sulfatase metachromatic leukodystrophy. That's yeah. the one. Yeah, you see that? I told you, man. It sounds it's it's kind of like MS, but in a baby. Yeah, yeah. Done. Yeah. Nice. Yes. That was awesome, man. That was awesome. Oh, this is great. This is fantastic, man. This is great, man. All right. Which diseases is the is the patient suffering from? Which of the following diseases does this patient suffer from? All right. Let's see. Let's see. Two year old physician, hearing loss. Okay, we got a two year old with hearing loss. Uh, he got a big old forehead, big old tongue. Hepatal splenomegaly is also interesting. He has an abdominal hernia. And, ah, I duro is missing. I, 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 I duro does, does an hunters. There it is. Hunters disease. Hunters. Yeah, hunters. Yeah, it I was duro. either going to be just by them saying I duro. Remember, yeah. it was going to be either hunters or Hurlers, oh, hurlers, yeah. Hurlers is L iduronidase. L, L, L in hurlers, L for L iduronidase. But you see, I duro, I hard, I duro. How do you say hard in Spanish? Duro. Yeah, That's it. Good. I duro. Yeah. Yeah. Nice man. Nice, 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 nice. Killing it, killing it. Great job. So yeah, this was hunters, 100. Uh, percent The only thing they could have uh, also added was again, um, maybe an aggressive attitude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, all right, deficient. 
which enzyme is deficient? Three-year-old boy. Uh, facial features. Yeah, huh. Right there. Bizarre facial features. I'm already thinking of something, right? Yeah. Hyperactive and aggressive. Mm-hmm. Okay. Big old forehead, big old tongue, hepatosplenomegaly. Fundoscopic that's, exams that's, reveal clear that's, corneas. That's I do. There it is. So yeah, I see two that say I duro. Not yeah, this one, not this one. Not, yeah. Nice. Not you sure it's not A, uh, B? No, no, no. That's, that's, that's exactly L I duro. That's right. I'm telling you, man, this is awesome. <laughs> Fantastic job. Fantastic job. Fantastic. All right, all right. Killing it, man. It's a good Friday. No, today's Thursday. Oof, so, yeah. feels like Friday. All right, diagnosis. Six-year-old, pain in the right hip. Six-year-old, pain in the right hip. Okay, okay, hip pain. So, let's see. Maybe osteoporosis? Maybe. No. We'll see. Osteoarthritis? <laughs> Six-year-old? Come on. Uh. So, pain, uh, a pain ar arose suddenly as they were walking home from a park. Okay. Uh, the boy has been in the ED for episodes of bone pain. Okay. So bone issues. He's, uh, blood. bruises blood. himself. Uh, blood yeah. and bone. Blood Interesting. Blood. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. Yeah. Let's yeah. see. Uh, he, one year ago, he underwent emergency surgery after his spleen was ruptured in the backyard after a football game. Uh, labs are okay. Blood pressure is a little low. Enlarged liver, lymphadenopathy. X-rays of the lower extremities show a fracture of the femoral head. So, blood and bone diagnosis. That's 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 as good as this is. Killing it, man. That's how we do it. That's good All day, it. every day, man. Gauchers, blood and bone. Please remember that. Blood and bone. Blood and bone. That's right. That's right. You know they got this. Uh, I I don't. I haven't seen them mention it. Um, I haven't seen them mention it too much. But it was something I remember. They have this a, a unique. It's like a tertiary finding, meaning a rare finding. They call them Erlenmeyer flask legs. You ever heard For of that? The gotcha, the gotcha disease. For yeah, yeah. Erlenmeyer. So you remember the Erlenmeyer flask? I don't even know if I'm pronouncing them right. Erlenmeyer flask. Do you remember what that was? The big old chemistry, the big old glasses that we used in chemistry, you know, oh, to mix. Oh, oh, yeah. Their legs kind of look like that because it's like a pseudo hypertrophy that they, that occurs in their lower leg, like in their calf. Very, very similar to Duchenne, but they call Erlenmeyer Meyer flask legs. Yeah, it's. I don't know if they. I, I doubt that they use the term anymore. But uh, look it up. They don't mention it much anymore. But it, it is something I do remember. I found it to be unique. I'm like, really? That's crazy. All right. <laughs> Nice. Yeah. The patient's yeah. disorder is caused by a disruption of which of the following processes? Disorder caused by a disruption of which of the following? Well, all right. Let's find out what disorder and what's disrupted. 30-year-old. Yeah. Uh, he's become erratic. He has not been himself. Depress uh, depression. Let's see. Uh, his speech is uncoordinated. Abnormal gait. Interesting. Hard time finding his balance. All right, so we got a guy going all over the place like this. On exam, he has asterixis, big old spleen, big liver. Ah, dark annular deposits, annular, annulus, like ring-like, in the corneas with yellow skin. Diagnosis and a tremor. Diagnosis? Mm. Mm -hmm. Is this, not, is this, this should be Copa's disease. That's right. Which one is? Well, there it is. So the disorder is a disruption in which of the following, which one says copper disease? Only yeah, that's B. That's yeah, B. You, you got it, man. Yeah, that's, Wilson's yeah. disease. Copper Wilson's disease. disease. Sorry, Wilson's. <laughs> that's 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 uh, the 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 dark and light that was around the highest corner is the what's it called? Uh, split something? Split? Uh, split? The one they use is checking the eyes. Uh, what you're asking the the test? The test, yeah. The split, split light. Split, split light, light, yeah, light, yeah. They have this yeah. Green, they have this split lamp, stuff. split lamp. I'm sorry, split, split lamp. Yeah, split I like lamp. They have this green stuff in your corner, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, very good, very good, very good, very good. That was Wilson's. All right, cool. So remember, it is a ceruloplasmin deficiency. Yes, my question. what is yes. what does ceruloplasmin do? Like, what is its purpose? Chaos, right? what does he do? Like what's it? Ceru 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 yeah, what does it do? What is it, what is it supposed to do? Because therefore, uh, it being deficient causes the accumulation of copper. So what is it supposed to do, logically speaking? 
It's supposed to decrease copper metabolism. Decrease decrease copper. Not yeah. decrease metabolism, but decrease copper. Okay, decrease so what copper. is it? It literally just grabs copper from the liver and it brings it down into the duodenum to be excreted in the poo. That's oh, it. Okay. Supposed yeah, to literally okay. put out. That's its job. Okay. But if I don't have any cerebroplasm, well, then it can't do that. So it accumulates. See? Right, boss. And make sure you know it goes into the basal ganglia, which is why yeah, it causes... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Basal ganglia, yeah. All right, what enzyme is deficient? Let's do this. 11-year-old boy, enzyme is deficient. Seizures, sweating, dizziness, nausea. All right. Uh, 32 hours without any food. Stuck on a mountain. Mm-hmm. Uh, he had similar complaints in the past with fasting. Interesting. He's 11. All right. Pulse is high. Decreased muscle tone. Liver and spleen are palpated. So hepatosplenomegaly. Po oh, positive urinary ketones. Increased CK. Decreased glucose. Lactate is normal. Mm. What do you think he has? Positive urinary ketones. Increase increased creatinine kinase. Mm -hmm. uh, How severe is this disease? Uh, what's 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 there's no blood glucose level? They it said is, decrease. It it decrease decrease blood glucose level and lactate yes. and lact and lactate level. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it's severe. It's not it's not so severe. So then, which one is it? The seizure. Oh, because of seizure, it's severe. Okay. So this should be, this should be, yeah, this should, yeah, this should be, Say. yeah, this should be glucose phosphate deficient. That's bon very bon nice. Bon 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 oh, bon nice try, but no. Oh, so, so let's go to. So uh, therefore, if it wasn't von Gerk, then what had, what was it? What did it have to be? Because von Gerk always presents with this is this was the giveaway. I agree. I also thought von Gerk, but it's not von Gerk because lactate levels. Yeah, lactate well, is within no, 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 reference they're, 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 range, they're, they're, meaning it has they're, they're, to be the other one that's, that's not as Corey, severe. Which is Corey Corey's, that's why I asked that's you how severe is it oh, debranching. You see that? That's so why I asked it you how severe it wasn't that serious. It wasn't that serious. Given, yeah, you can get seizures and sweating and all that. Okay, I get it. But it's not as severe. Okay. This, I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm curious to see how many people got it right. 40, that's what I thought. Because of the way that they, they worded this question. I, mm -hmm. The way mm -hmm. that it was worded. So mm -hmm. I bet many people went, yeah, many went with, uh, yeah, with Von Gerg, G6PD, 30%. Yeah. Yep, yep, yeah. that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So, okay, anyways, it was worded uh, a little oddly, given the lactate levels was a giveaway. Yeah, and yeah. the hepatosplenomegaly, yeah. mm, that's, a, that's, it's, that's a plus or minus, right? Sometimes it presents, sometimes it doesn't. Uh, right, right. So I, I don't know. but I, I don't blame you. I don't blame you for, for choosing... Um, for thinking Von Gerks, because that is very severe. And the guy is seizing. So, all right. Nice. Yeah. Let's go on to the last one. Okay. All right. Defects. Which of the following defects is associated? Wait, give me a second. What time is it? Okay. Which of the following defects is associated with the patient, with this patient's most likely condition? Okay. So what does this patient have? 18-month African-American baby. Mm. Uh, failure to thrive. Small, coarse facial features. Corneal clouding. Diagnosis, hepatomegaly. Diagnosis. Cornea clouding and that's a um, cornea clouding and, and coarse facial features. That's that's Nema speaks. Think about it. No, no, cornea clouding and uh, that should be coarse uh, facial uh, features. Uh, yeah, that should be hunt or uh, huntlers. Which which one? Huntlers? <laughs> Is no, it hunters hunt, or hurlers? Hunters, hunters disease. Hunters or hurlers? Which one has the coarse facial features? Hurlers, sorry. Hurlers. Hurlers. Hurlers has the coarse Holas. facial features. Remember, they got the, the gargoyle the, face. The I, yeah, the L, I, yeah, hurlers. Exactly. Nice, Holas, nice. Yeah. All right, good. Uh, he has arthropathy, limited mobility in the knees and the joints, sure. Um, fibroblasts cultured are found to have deficiencies in specific lysosomal enzymes. Yes. Blood and urine, including uh, mucopolysaccharides, electron yeah, microscopy yeah, shows, yeah, uh, prominent yeah. vascularization, da, 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 da. defects yeah. associated with the following. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm. This is actually a lot easier than what I thought. This, I thought this was a little bit. Okay. So what is this? Go ahead. What What uh, is it not? I, I know. I know. It's not. It's not. It's not D. All right. Good. It's, it's not, not D. 
It's not C. It's not C? It's not B. It's not B? Defect in protein going to go. Defect in metabolism is an essential amino acid. What are the essential amino acids in there? Okay. Is this an amino acid disease? Mm. Mm. What are these called? These diseases that Hurler per pertains to? I think it's E. All right. That's not what I asked. Okay. I asked what do they pertain to, and you were, your answer is lysosomal storage disease is the answer. Yeah, it's lysosomal storage disease. Okay, right. Lysosomal, that's lysosomal okay. storage, not amino acid disease. Okay, yeah. yeah lysosomal yeah, yeah, storage. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God, I missed You up. see? Yeah. Yeah. Boom. Okay. A. Oh, that's eye cell disease? Oh, yeah, eye cell disease. I was thinking, I was with you, I was also thinking hurlers, but this was eye cell. Okay. Here's my question, though. A lysosome, right? A lysosome. What? Mm -hmm. Where, where does it get its enzymes from? The enzymes that that it, that it uses to degrade these these things. Um, right? oh, that just go, go apparatus? from the Golgi apparatus with yeah, the help of mannose six phosphate. Yeah. Uh, oh. So you see what I'm saying? It's yeah. it is a lysosomal disease, just iso disease. Okay, cool. That's, that's right. I hadn't thought about I hadn't thought about uh um, iso. Yeah, that's right. Also, coarse facial features too, as well, just like hurlers. Nice. All right, man. All right, very, boss. Very nice. Very nice. Let's see. Let's see. Very good.